Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back, everyone. I thank you for your time. I'm focusing this session on the captain of this boat, this ship, this flight. As we continue to transverse the terrains of the world in search of our precious child, baby testimony, and we continue to stand in support with our sister Ruth Matthew until that child is found. We are all privy to the fact that so many people crawled out of the various crevices of nooks and crannies of the world to accuse prophets. They've said so many things about this young man. I'm very certain that not many young men in the world would be able to withstand the heat, the arrows that have come his way, and he's still standing. Not many young men would remain. What what does he stand to gain by standing in the direct firing line of all these accusations from one lie to another? His character people have tried to destroy, assassinate his character. They have said all kinds of things. He has been accused, abused, insulted, threatened, cursed. Declarations have been made. His photographs have gone in, into all kinds of places that only those who have done those things are aware of. He has been accused of collecting money, cashing out, making money, using Ruth Matthew, using all of us. <sighs> the list is endless. If I go back to the number of people on Facebook who came under the comment I made in videos that Perfect had posted and said things about him, cashing out, using our heads, and I, I, I think the list would be endless of people who came to say all those things about accusing prophets. But I'm so grateful to God that the majority of those people, maybe they have died. I do not see them no more. The, the forerunners of the accusation bandwagon, YouTube carpenter fake Dr. Chidi. Of course, Solomon, the hungrier, jobless housewife. Dad, the, the little boy. A few other platforms I do not recall. They were all led on that crusade by the one and only line machine. Failed actors and failed in all other works of life. Ogala Doris. They have heaped lies, said all kinds of things. But today, where are they? Where are all those people? She has tried to sneak back into this case. Sorry, there's no room for you. Nobody cares, like I said previously. Nobody's listening to you. You are obsolete now. You belong to the old stone age. So I'm just asking. What are they up to? Why are they not? At, what did they find out? Why have they stopped coming at Prophet? Have they run out of materials on him? Prophet is still where, where he was because they came as well to say he was running up and down, running everywhere. Even Cassie, the one who needs help, came to say he was moving from place to place. I didn't know he was traveling with Prophet. But where are they today? All kinds of people who have tried to throw dirt at this young man. Yes, he collected money. So what? He is still standing. He is still here, speaking, fighting for justice for Ruth Matthew and for us to locate baby testimony. Where are you guys? You were paid some stipends and you have done your, your duty. You have run back to hiding. May you remain in your hiding and may you receive the reward for all the nasty things that you did. You will never go unpunished for ever coming out to do whatever you did on this case. You all will never be unpunished. 
you are, some of you are still there doing the nonsense you, you, you know to do. I just feel sorry for you. I do not understand how any human being would deliberately destroy him or herself. You do not understand, you do not know, you do not care. Get out of this case of baby testimony. It's not for the faint-hearted. It's not for those people who think that they can just come and, and say any nonsense. That child is fighting. You will not go scot-free. But thank you so much to Prophet, who has continued to stand gallantly with all the able warriors behind him. It was such a pleasure when I go on the live presentations and see the numbers of lovely, wheeling, brave men and women sharing their support who are willing to stand and find this child. Shout out to you all. Shout out to you all. Love, 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 love. Shout out to you all. You guys are powerful people. We will not be intimidated. The fake accounts that have been set up to, sh to, to come and make comments, to show up in live shows and, and try to distract people. Nobody cares about you. Nobody's paying attention to you guys no more. We are still working and standing with Ruth Matthew. We are all united. We are all working together until justice is done. We do not know how baby testimony is going to come out. But I see in my spirit that he's around the corner and he's coming back pretty soon. To the glory of our great God, who alone can be trusted. Let us say thank you. Let us appreciate our dear brother Prophet, because this is not easy to commit himself to. May God continue to protect him, guide him, give him wisdom. As more and more deceptive liars show up, he will not be misled. He'll be granted more wisdom, more knowledge and understanding, the ability to discern and see through. Well, we're all standing here with him to help to, to point out any nonsense that shows up. But we want him to adequately continue to stand free, no matter what charge, what anybody says. There's nobody. Thank God so much. He is not from that country. Thank God. God alone knows why he did not allow any other of these useless bloggers to find this case before Prophet took it on board. They all knew about it, but they stayed away. And they thought they could come and catch, cash out and rubbish it. But thank you, Prophet. You are loved. You are appreciated. You are special. We will continue to stand with you, all of us. Those of us around here, we are here in the comments with our little voices. We will continue to stand with you. Never relent. Never give up. Just get, let us all continue because baby testimony needs all of us. So, and thank you guys, everyone as well, who has continued steadfastly on this journey. We will all be here to celebrate, to thank God for everything that he would have done. And the glory will return to him. We will all rejoice with Ruth Matthew to God's glory. God bless all of us.